so these are the pieces what I got from Tallinn thrifting hi they're wasting time let me show you what I've got because these are so amazing and I'm so obsessed and I just can't wait to share this hi besties it's been wow such a long time um I wanted to share this with you so long but because everything is back literally last night that I took some of the pieces out and I was like okay I have to show you guys these because these are so good they're so so good also if you don't want to be rude and you're new on my channel or if you are returning to my channel but you haven't subscribed you can subscribe also down below there thanks and comment and like this video well if you've seen my phone video I have this dummy phone since i came back first thing i did i got this phone so it was like 30 quid or something i have video on my channel so you can check it out it's like 90 style the all the nail polish and stickers on so that's something new i played around with the hair extensions today because i don't want to wear like wig all the time and going with the wig outside is like it's really hot so many things going on so i'm in a process of you know like life is changed i'm in my new studio it's been crazy last two months and a few weeks i'm going to uni on monday um which is super exciting i haven't studied such a long time but i decided i want to i wanted to study and go to university a really long time because I have al already previous degrees but I was like I have time and I want to study something I want to challenge myself um, so I'm going to study business um, and I'm starting with the foundations because I just want to start from the basics and then move up so um, that's something new new house university I got super cute stuff um, there's the things which I already have uploaded to my Instagram there's things which I have uploaded already to my vintage so example this guest bag I was like so excited when I found this this is going really well with my style with my hair um, it's a bit like rock and rolly one but at the same time it's like feminine as well I think it's super super cute like I was so excited when I found this I like street style but I need to really like add some girly pieces and I think this one is really like in between street style rock and roll and um, also girly because of the elements of this i put this also in my vintage because i just can't keep all the things i will wear it but it's also there like, like a filming camera and stuff it fits a lot of things it's like long baguette style and it's not too heavy but i'm absolutely obsessed with this this is definitely the piece which is so hard to part ways with I can't keep everything and I literally just thrifted these pieces to bring for you guys. Scandinavia has lots of um, the special collection pieces and this is part of that. These I wore a lot. Men's were medium. The strings, I was like tightening it up with this and I didn't have to even put belt on. And it goes with everything. The color is everything. Probably something which I will keep. Don't worry guys, I have loads of um cargo pants options for vintage as well the type of cargo pants and stuff i find a lot from the menswear and i just wear them and i'm like four nine or four five zero it's like tie up with the safety pins i've been wearing these loads especially when we went to sell the kuromi sunrio stuff for kids me and my upcoming like ex-husband um, we went so many different areas in Estonia and we took part of these different festivals. What I noticed in there when we were there, uh, renovating the house and living there, shops there was not many uh, options for kids. Just order the things and we went there and the kids loved those and even a few girls been texting me if I have more. If you watched the previous little vlogs, you've seen that I went to different shops um so these are the some of the things which i've got and which i love one of the shops uh, the commission shops in uh, old town um were 
I used to go all the time and I found the cutest stuff and also this time I found the cutest stuff and I found this bag I, I don't know my obsession with green I need to just share my I think I have to make a video of the green things what I purchased recently but somehow the green this I just I just really really love this bag it's a slouchy bag and I was thinking to add loads of little uh, bag charms on it so and my vintage scandinavia logo as well do this bag like i'm not sure if i will put it to vintage yet because i'm just so obsessed with this and i like the little flap as well one thing i don't really wear is like designery bags like uh, mainstream uh, designer bags i like these cute bags which doesn't really have significantly known logos i for sure know no one gonna walk in front of me going to the city and that's what I love and I can also carry Jiggy Jigs is sitting on my bag so this is perfect size he can just sit on this while I'm holding him like that so he can put his little toes on it so oh, I just oh, I have so much fun when I am thrifting by myself I don't like to thrift with anyone with me because I'm in my zone I'm like I don't know something happens with my brain when I'm going for thrifting and secondhand shopping and when I'm shopping by myself I found so many cute things it's a brand and tailor and what I like about this the crystal buttons on it it's like so gorgeous it's like kind of see-through but when I wear my um, sporty tops, then you can't really see it. Look at this one. It's like, like silver thread, like tiny bit shiny. Mohair is definitely one of my top favorite for knits as well, especially for the light knits. And I noticed these light uh, materials on the top part of my body they look the best, like because it's really feminine, and then I can uh, pair it with. The menswear cargoes example is a perfect pair and i'm silvery be the bracelets um when i came back to london and i absolutely love it and also with my rings uh, silver for at least 10 years i was convinced i'm definitely only wearing gold but somehow i went back and especially these little like shiny silvery details i absolutely love and somehow it just looks really soft with my features and I'm definitely a girl who is mixing like gold and metal together like like no other and clearly this is really great type of uh, thrifting haul because I got also these type of Nike trainers these are the Nike and off-white collaboration it's a little sharpie any got the trainer and the really hot fuchsia pink like bottom and this double lacing I really love off-white in general because of the the street style vibes when it dropped 2019 I don't know how I missed it but these are amazing these are awesome and they are not that heavy um, sometimes these type of like collaboration trainers and especially when it comes to designer trainers or sneakers they can be really heavy um, but these are really lightweight as well which is a bonus and they just look so cool and even when I wear those example with the cargos or cargo skirts and um, then somehow this design it doesn't make my feet bigger because it's like literally one and a half size bigger but somehow they fit nicely I'm one day before my flight and I'm absolutely obsessed with every single piece and my main goal was to shop for my vintage to get the cool stock for autumn, for autumn and winter but i think i can't part the ways with any of these pieces planning to go back to tallinn really really soon maybe even next month and do more damage in a like second hand shops and in thrift shops and bring like more cute pieces uh, for you guys and i'm so excited to share this with you and if you enjoyed this video please join my family here and subscribe as well comment and like this video and if you don't want to miss any of my new videos then you can put notification 
on as well like you still need a bell button which you can put on for my channel so if i'm posting anything you can just check these out and i will see you next time here on my channel love you guys bye